What is up, guys? Bro, the king here bringing you some Pokemon Destiny Reign of Legends. Wait, Ruby Destiny Reign of Legends. Um, last time we left off, we like traveled quite a bit to this new place. Um, about to try and go get our seventh gym, then eighth gym, and then take on the Elite Four or whatever we have planned for in this mod or hack or whatever you want to call it. Um, anyway, let us continue on our journey. In search of trainers, Gabby, hi today. I'm visiting an area near B Woods. We're trying to spot some up and coming new talent in the field. Today we turned our lens on the trainer Brago. There's something about this trainer that cued our interest. We've battled Brago before, but we can attest that trainer has definitely improved from before. I know that we're on some search before we spot this trainer. Thus, we can determine so strongly, well, something fast, something, that's how we ended up battling with Brago, Domination, something, 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 Trainer, Axe, something, something, Celio, Laron, Celio and Laron, Iron Tail, Iron Tail is Celio and Laron's sign of friendship, okay, that's a lie, Celio, yes, yeah, Celio, not nice try something, okay, yeah, that was a little weird. Because Iron Tail is not their sign of friendship. Their sign of friendship is the Pokeballs that I keep them in that are under my control. So yes, get your facts right next time, please. And then we won't be having this problem. Iron Path. Okay. Thank you for pointing out the obvious. Oh, my fast forwarding is still so laggy. I do not know why. Which Pokemon do I have first? It's Mr. Stone. Yeah, I'm probably gonna train up to like level 38 and then I'm switching. What surprise didn't expect a kid to be out here all alone? I think we should battle. Okay, that's a little creepy, sir. Scyther versus Mr. Stone. Iron Tail, that was very laggy. Jesus of Christ. It's like I can't fast forward anymore. Whatever. <laughs> Let's go, Puff Puff. Ugh, I'm so tired. Ninjask, you screech, that's nice. Aerial Ace, get out of my face. I hit him with an Aerial Ace. Ace. 996 on 9,000. This kid's awfully tough. Yes, I know I am. I know I am. Ha ha ha. Alright, run through this. Run. Trying to avoid stepping in grass, because I do not like encountering wild Pokemon like all the time. I like this Pineco. Okay, so far so good. Oh crap. Huh, oh boy, another one that will give me a free rare Pokemon. Oh hi there, you new face run, let me guess. You're a tourist, right? Right. Thought you so you are. Here I go again. As Secretary will come in and give you a duty to give you remember their first visit to the island. Okay, but first. You're gonna get, let me choose a Pokemon type, right? Wow, you're psychic. Do you like grass? No. Okay. Fire. So I've already got grass and water. So yeah, sure, why fire? Why not? Send a quill from Weird Guy. Oh, wow. So you mean you met the president and voice and the vice president of the walking committee. That's awesome here. Thanks. Now I'm gonna go now. Be careful in your journey, okay, kid? Well, I'm sure you will. See ya. Yeah, tired of getting free Pokemon from those guys. As Pokemon Ranger, it is my duty to protect both trainers and Pokemon. Okay, that is nice. I do not really care what you have to do. I just wanted to defeat you to get some experience for my Pokemon. Take down. Goodbye, Piplup. Sorry about that. Prinplup. Okay. Mm -hmm. I see this is escalating quickly. Take down. Ooh, Fury Attack. Alright, laggy a bit. It's lagging up a bit. Take down misses. He's free attacking. Yeah, this is getting quite laggy. <sighs> I hate not being able to fast forward because... I like fast forwarding with the fast commentary and stuff. I have Plimplup's out. What is it? Empoleon? Yes, Empoleon. So, I can send in my fire type. I mean, um, what's it face? Phoenix. Well, yeah, let's do it. Because I got hope for my Phoenix. Bring it on. Boo. <laughs> Double kick. I did not know what to call it, so I just said boo. Alright, 1000. Goodbye. Pokemon Ranger who uses water types. Okay. That's cool. That's very cool. Just running through these patches of grass. Just like avoiding them Pokemon. Teddy Ursa. 
Goodbye. Don't really want to fight a teddy air, so right now. Oh my god. Pichiotto. Don't feel like fighting a Pichiotto either. Or either. Repel. There you go. Leaf path. And it's a ninja kid. Thinking that a board would really hide him. To hide a tree, use the forest. Man, that was deep. Alright, so take down. Ooh, level 33. See, like, they're actually starting to catch up my Pokemon's levels. It's been a while since anybody's been able to actually be par with my Pokemon's levels. Because I actually overtrained them a bit. So they're actually quite above what standard leveling would be, I guess you could say. Whatever. Smoke screen, and the smoke didn't even come out of the screen, or the smoke in the ball. I bow to your superiority. Thank you, child of the hit and mist jutsu place. Turn and tips, you renowned leaf path, and up ahead is the Weather Institute. It is where scientists study the weather in Genta region, Iron Path, Green Valley. Okay, so I think I want to be going Green Valley. First, let me get these berries. Pomeg. They don't sound poisonous, so I'll take them. Yay, Pomeg berries. The Weather Institute and Team... Huh. Whatever. Don't crib a crap what they are anymore. They're gonna lose. That's what they are. Alright, so... Kid over there, I believe he's gonna tell me I can rest in this bed. Yep. He loved my Pokemon. Actually did it again. Did not mean to do that. Well, I'll sleep here. Everyone went upstairs. Okay. Oh, is that computer? Did need to change? Yeah, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> did we need to change my group? Wait, 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 wait. I want to see what the Cyndaquil looks like. I'm sure it looks like a right. Yeah, Cyndaquil level 20. And then I have a Squirtle level 15. So, fire, water. I have two fire starters. One water. No, fire starters, one water, and one grass. Huh? What are you doing here, kid? Or doing here, kid? Wow, her shirt looks really tacky. LC. Like her gang that she's representing. Take down level 38. Thank you. Goodbye. Yes, you lost. It's not that surprising. You actually suck. I'm just trying to be honest. I don't want to be like someone who's not gonna tell you the truth. So yeah, you suck. Let me get my two fighting types. My psychic fighting and my firefighting. The boss got interested in the research they do, they have going on here, so he sent us out. You quit meddling. Alright. Ooh, a Delta Grunt. Send in a Cherim. Blaze Kick. And it misses. And he uses a takedown. Dang, Blaze Kick. Get out of my face. Sandler. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. That I could easily take that out with fighting. Come on, Sandler. Like, this is such an underrated Pokemon. Like, barely anybody knows about it. Barely any any people barely know about it, I guess. I don't know how to word that. But, like, it's so underrated. Like, people barely know what the F of Sandler is. Or Stanler. Stanler. Whatever. I can't. I don't know. <laughs> Level 38. It's awesome. Delta Grant's a blasted. You got beat by a kid. Yeah, I know. Happens to everyone who fights me. Not that surprising. So, yeah. Alright, Sai and Gaia get up there. Alright. This dude created a type of Pokemon that has something to do with the weather. We're here to take them. Alright. Shanks versus Sai teleports. I mean, Psychic, not teleports. <laughs> wow. Luxio, Luxio, whatever you want to call him. He's dead. Ooh, no, he survives. Sends out a roar. Aurora beamed. They're out. Our plans being spoiled by a kid. Yep. They look like those guys look like Egyptian sort of like dudes. We lunar centuries appear whenever we desire. Okay. They look look look. It's like some kind of Egyptian where it looks pretty cool. I like it. Sceneries, luminous sceneries. I guess that's what you call it. All right. So. Only move I have is Psychic, I forgot. So I'm like looking for another move to use, but I forgot. Only move. He has a Psychic, Drift Blim, Psychic. Use a Stockpile. Stockpiled one. 
Psychic. You spit up. I use Psychic. Should have used Swallow. Get your health back. Dust Tox. I believe that's Poison type, so it'd be super effective. Yup, I was correct. There you go, level 38. You got me. I know I did, sir. Luminous Sceneries. I believe that's how you pronounce it. I'm not sure, because I suck at pronouncing things in video games, because they always have weird names. And everybody pronounces stuff differently, which confuses me. But whatever. Alright, so... Here you are again, trying to meddle with our affairs. You're either absolutely fearless, simply ignorant, or both. But I won't let you win like the last time in Mount Blaze, kid. Okay. Luminous, cener Luminous Sceneries Alpha Tabitha challenge you to a battle. Alright, Tabitha. Let's do this. Me versus you. Earthquake. Super effective. Goodbye. That was nice. Come on, Luxray. Wow, our Pokemon, their Pokemon actually are caught up, but they suck. Ahaha, you're disgustingly strong. Yes, I know that. Ahaha, we got meddled with unexpectedly. We're out of options. We'll have to pull out. But this isn't the last you'll see of LC. We have other plans. Don't you forget it. Thanks, thanks. You were safe. It might be an odd way of thanking you, but take this Pokemon. Hmm, you don't have any room for this Pokemon. Uh, thank you, because I do not want cast form. It cast sucks. I guess you could say that. Take a rest right quick and get out of here because this place is full of weirdos. Alright, Leaf Path, and I believe we can continue now. Gaia, I'll just leave you up front. And then we should be able to get caught by our rival. Yep, Tabitha, or Tamashi, my bad. <laughs> Brago, have you heard of Royal Darkness? Oh, so you already knew about it. Okay, say, you want to have a battle? Yes, you were like decades lit, Tamashi, really. Like, I've been fighting Royal Darkness before they even got, like, known that well. Oh, using Vital Throw. Okay, give me the health. Thank you. Razor Leaf. Using Vital Throw again. Okay, give me some more of that health. The more you Vital Throw me, the more you get your health zapped. Earthquake. Thank you. Experience level 38. Dragonair. Ooh. Perfect for Sub Zero or Puff Puff. Either or. Aurora Beam uses Dragon Rage. Aurora Beam. Oh, almost out. Uses Dragon Rage again. Hopefully, it doesn't get critical. And it doesn't. Aurora Beam. Goodbye. Thank you. Pikachu. No, that would be stupid. Send in Gaia. Pikachu, use the double team. I just use Earthquake and I miss. I'm not sure how that's possible. Oh, there you go. That shouldn't have missed. Goodbye. Wow, Brega, you're strong. I was worried that you might be struggling with your training and you lose to me all the time and you're worried about my training. You're very strong. Hehe. <laughs> oh, well, here. I want you to have this. Here you go. HMO2, which I believe is Fly. Use fly and your Pokemon will instantly carry you to a town you've already visited. You'll be having to problem. You'll be having to use since you've got the Marine Blast. But you know, you should fly home and visit Sunford for a change. I bet your mom's worried about you, Brago. Well, let's meet again somewhere. Alright, so now I have fly. Thank goodness. Because I needed fly. And everybody's here now. Everything's all normal. Take a rest in bed. Get out of here. Oh, anyway, let's use this fly TM that we just got, or HM, when I bad, not what I was expecting. Alright, Puff Puff, since you're the only one who actually knows or is a flying type, let's see. What can I take out to fly? Because it's 95% accurate, Aerial Ace never misses, it's unavoidable. Takedown, well yeah, because takedown, you're not really the tanky type to use takedown in the first place, so... Yeah, we already have Mr. Stone for that, so you're pretty much not going to be able to use that very well. Green Path, Leaf Path, or Green Valley. Hanzu Berries, they look like some kind of darkness looking berry. I'm not sure. Whatever. Let's go, kid. Unfold your board and fight me. To lurk in shadows and live in darkness, that is my destiny. I emerge to challenge you, okay? It's like some Team Royal Darkness grunts. In training, oh crap, I forgot I have Guy in lead. 
Need to change him. Earthquake, you're out. Thank you. And you're out. Like I said, thank you. Um, well, this is gonna be the end of this part. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, uh, next time we'll be continuing. And actually, the next part will be going up tomorrow because since I am training, uh, Pokemon Silver will be getting uploaded for a while, so I'll just be uploading Pokemon Ruby Destiny. Since I really enjoy this mod and I like playing it, it is very fun because I don't do mods very often. I have not actually done a mod ever in my life. This is the first time, so it's a little something new. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, remember to like, comment, subscribe, check out the previous part, check out my Pokemon Silver walkthrough. And uh, this is Burrow the King, and I'll be seeing you guys later. A peace out, son.